With cold temperatures sweeping across the area, most people are bundled up inside, but not everybody has that luxury. Today, News Channel 9's Micaiah Thurman spoke to someone whose job requires them to be outside all day. Micaiah. Whether it's rain, floods, or snow, it's important for letter carriers to get everything delivered timely and as best as they can. But of course, most important is their safety and the safety of others. We've heard the creed. Neither snow, nor rain, nor heat, nor gloom of night. Mail carriers across the country are forced to brave all sorts of weather conditions to perform their jobs. We're on the road six to seven hours a day, whether they're walking, doing uh, dismounts, uh, walking up to porches, these porches and the steps get slick, so that's a concern when it gets icy. Alan Little has worked as a U.S. Postal Service mailman for the last 37 years. He has to trudge along whether it's 95 degrees or when it's record-setting cold temperatures. While it's difficult to deliver the mail in all kinds of weather, there are things that you can do to help your local carrier. If you have a curb line mailbox, keep the the mailbox approach and departure clear so that the carriers don't have to pull in, back up, uh, or even dismount because the roads can be slick. And because of those slick roads, letter carriers use all sorts of techniques, such as snow chains, to stay safe. They'll go around the rear tires and then they kind of clamp with the, the rubber. The manager tells me that they haven't had any employee accident or injuries at the Highland Park station. However, they have had some deliveries that could not be made because of the weather. Kim. Okay, thank you. And in the event of icy road conditions, mail trucks attach snow chains to the rear tires to help with the traction.